Hi, welcome back to Rebecca's Travels or if you're um, watching my lifestyle channel, welcome back to Rebecca's Lifestyle. Uh, today I'm going to be doing the latest travel news worldwide, part one. So let's jump right into it. I've got eight fascinating travel facts uh, which is the latest travel news so let's jump right into it now point one carnival cruise line delays mardi gradel debut um carnival cruise line has delayed the debut of mardi gras until 2021 um it's set to become the first LNG powered ship. Wow, that sounds amazing to operate in the Western Hemisphere. Itineraries um, have been planned from November the 14th, um, but again, they're probably going to be planning the itineraries on the 14th of November and but um, again they're delaying it until next year again I think it's a wise move um, during the current situation and plus I think it would be a lot less easier to say social distance on cruise ships um, and um with cruise ships traveling to different places on their itinerary um again um it just it just really is uh, less uh, safe so um i'm glad that um again that um they've decided to uh, launch next year rather than this year but I think it'll be absolutely awesome when it, lo it launches and good luck to Carnival Cruise at Lion um, for next year so hopefully it'll be fingers crossed up and running next year and Point two or fact two is Hitch Gurten, excuse my pronunciation of offered UK sailing in September MS Ronald um Muse then excuse my pronunciation will embark on a series of short break expedition cruises in the UK waters in September this year that's fantastic news um her tigun excuse my pronunciation again will become the first expedition cruise line to depart from the UK from a UK port Ex excellent news again um short cruises um again are ideal um for people say that want to go on say between a five seven day cruise um that really just want to test out really what it's like to cruise um and te uh, test what it also it's like to visit say a few places um and see what it's like to eat and drink and say sleep on a, a cruise before committing to a longer say 20 day cruise for example or say a, a longer around the world cruise just to see whether they enjoy it. most people though um that have been on cruises that i know have really enjoyed them and um really do love them um so it's just really to test um also uh, whether a cruise uh, is going to be for you um 
and it's a good way instead of spending up a lot of money, heap of money on a long cruise um, and obviously finding it, it wasn't for you um, if you spend say less money um, on a shorter cruise then if you haven't cruised before then you can find out whether it's for you or not um, moving over to fact three american express, express business travel launches travel vitals american express global business travel has launched wow travel vitals a travel briefing platform that gives travel managers a single source for all information they need before and during and after a business trip um, so that's fantastic news and again travel um travel agents could probably again uh, go to a, a, a country and especially if it's the same country that you're looking to travel to or the same place that you're looking to travel to they can give you you um more expert knowledge and um, obviously you can find out online and by reading books um some information about the area that you're tra uh, traveling to what's near it etc on google but um and what facilities that are in the area that you're traveling to but um and also pictures but um they can give you more information of uh, say what uh, the locals are like and um etc et um uh, what to try out uh what say to avoid um etc so um again I think again it's a brilliant app um, or um, or a brilliant platform and it can provide a lot of information um, to, to say travel managers travel agents etc um, fact number four Poland welcomes uh, British travellers as the borders reopen again. Yay! I um, would love to travel to Poland um, again sometime in the future. Um, again, if I um, went on outside of a European trip again, then I would definitely uh, want to make uh, Poland um as um again my top uh, priority as to where um i would like to travel to um reason being um i would love to see the the tatras mountains at, at cracker path um say warsaw and different places and also at uh, energy land uh, there at brilliant theme park um so that's excellent news and well done to poland for that and um yes it it just looks some um amazing country to go and travel to and visit um and uh, the polish people again um it seemed very friendly um as well so um yes it's just a place that i'd i'd like to travel to um plus to try out some polish food and drink so <laughs> that would be interesting as well so well done for poland for opening at the borders i hope 
fingers crossed everything goes according to plan and as safely as possible like anywhere else in the world um number five uh, royal caribbean uh joins norwegian uh, for new safety body so again well done to royal camp caribbean and norwegian for collaborating together for a new safety body and i hope that goes as well as and safely as pro possible and um, fact number six air canada returns to ireland for the first time wow uh, yay that's good news uh, for both air canada and our uh, um ireland so um that's really good news and um, i hope everything again goes as well and as safely as possible number seven one world uh, launches a new passenger safety portal um so again i hope that goes as well as possible and as safety as po possible as well so uh, well done to one world and um, I, I really hope passengers um, enjoy it as well and um, last but not least finally American Airlines which is point, at point number eight, arrive at Ethero Terminal 5 yesterday. And well done to American Airlines and Heathrow Terminal 5 for that. And again, I hope everything goes as smoothly and as safely as possible. And again, I really hope um, travel firms or anyone in the travel leisure industry um is uh, basically um being able to um again get back into work and um hopefully um customers will be able to enjoy the experience so thank you for watching please like and subscribe if you haven't already done so um on both my travel channel and my lifestyle channel also ring the notification bell and um, it gives you frequent lifestyle and travel videos every week um so there'll be between three and four travel videos a week and lifestyle videos and um, there'll be um about four lifestyle or five lifestyle videos a week so again please keep watching i love you all please everybody stay safe and i hope again you can travel to where you want to travel to as soon as safely as possible um don't forget um again i love you all subscribers and viewers and you all mean the world to me and bye for now my next video is going to be what is open in the uk right now and obviously what is not and that is going to be tomorrow's video so please keep tuned that's going to be on my travel and lifestyle channel so everyone goodbye for now love you all thank you bye